Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to the Aquarius. Today, we are back out because a new update has arised, and uh, I've been working on the aquariums a little bit, added some sea turtles uh, that we obtained in the last episode to our main uh, attraction here. They also added these automatic feeders, so I added them to all the tanks, and hopefully that should make my life a little bit easier. The one thing I still do have to feed, though, is the big guys. I forgot how expensive shark food was. 156 each? Does it auto feed them now? Oh no, it comes over here. Okay. All right. So because I added a bunch of small fish too, I want to make sure these guys are fed. Hopefully they don't eat them. So far, so good. There you guys go. Have a delicious uh, piece of meat. All right, but we are not here to uh, enjoy some of the old content, but we should probably uh, end this day so we earn a little bit more money. I still have so many tanks I have to fill. I hate that those tanks got deleted because I did spend a lot of time on those. Uh, so yeah, we definitely don't have a crazy satisfaction just because my entrance room is very barren. But the rest of this place is looking pretty good, as you can see now. And how do we do? 1,771. Yeah, my satisfaction is still extremely low. And I'm assuming because this room is barren. Hopefully we can change that today with this new update. So if we go over here, we have a new locked door. And this has got to be one of the coolest updates yet. Uh, we have an expedition room. Essentially, what we can do now is go find fish species by swimming. So we are catching them from the wild. Now, I think that's kind of uh, sick because um, it does happen in real life. And unfortunately, a lot of aquarium species have to be hand caught. I do not want to ruin ecosystems, but let's remember this is a game. So we're going to go to see the underwater ruins and there's supposed to be like 30 new fish or something like that. Uh, deep sea fish as well. So, oh my God, I'm super excited to see how this works. Welcome to my underwater world, more precisely in an underwater base prepared for you, especially for the expedition of the seabed in this previously, previously unexplored area. Our diagnosis shows that there are many rare species of fish here, coral and treasures that we need to explore. I must praise the excellent job that the Hellsbitter did to create the building for us. If you want to see and build in this building for yourself as well as many other buildings, check out the House Builder. Interesting. All right, so it's mentioning a camera, so I might just need to snap shots of the uh, species to get them unlocked. I don't know much about it. Also, it is polluted. I mean, typical Earth, you know, humans are pretty good at polluting the whole place. So it looks like we might have to clean it up. All right, I didn't, wow. Okay, so not only is this an expansion, but he, what? Okay, hey little guy, how's it going? What are you doing in here? I haven't seen it, oh my God, where are you going? <laughs> oh God, that's hilarious. Okay, so yeah, we need photos to unlock expansions to our biome. Looks like my camera's right here, so we'll grab that. What else do we got, a flashlight, a hammer, so we can smack hammerheads in the head. And for whatever reason, a shovel as well. Can we build aquariums here? All right, I guess that's all we need. This guy's not telling me anything else. So I have to go out and take pictures of the first four specimens you come across. Could be anything. All right, this should be easy. Oh, I'm I'm very sinky. I'm, I, I must be very heavy. Oh, this is freaking cool though. Do you have any interest in rocks, sir? There you go. Doesn't seem to like rocks. I've already gotten these things, but uh, sure. We can do the Sinalera Flexibilis. 50 bucks? Oh, I earned money doing this? Oh, this is going to be so easy for money. Okay, I guess we can't take pictures of that. All right, so a lot of these we've already seen. Let's go see if we can get any uh, shots of these fish. Actually, let me see. Photo collections. Oh my god, I have a scrapbook. <laughs> so we do have hammerheads, obviously. A bunch of different species. And uh, looks like we got treasures we can find. And then, of course, the actual uh, fish as well. This is interesting. This is a whole different play style for this game. So it's nice to see. Plus, at least for the start, it's going to be very er easy money because I can just take pictures of all these things. I wish I could float better. I'm I'm sinking so fast. So trying to get these little guys is going to be hard. Oh, I should read the bottom left. Okay, control kind of keeps myself neutrally buoyant. So that makes a lot more sense. I believe that is a new fish. That looks to be a barracuda of some sort. Oh, it's a mackerel. Okay, clearly I don't know my uh, sea fish very well. Ah, uh, there's the big boy. Do I get $50 for him as well? Because that feels kind of cheap. Hey, buddy. Yeah, $50 a picture. So it doesn't matter if it's the smallest fish or biggest fish. You get $50 a pop. Okay, so we want to get statues as well. It's a good thing I looked at that book because I wouldn't have expected that. But uh, yeah, we want pictures of everything here. Oh, we got massive stingray. I do not believe that stingray were in the game before. Is this a sunfish? 
Oh, it's a Mahi Mahi, which I believe is another name for the Sunfish. Uh, I don't think that was in the game. Again, it's been a while since I last played, so it might be. I kind of forget. But this is just so cool. I'm going to earn so much. I actually need a, a lot of money right now. So hopefully we can earn a bunch of money here. But yeah, $50 a pop really actually might take a while to earn a decent amount of money here. But I mean, it's just so cool that I can find fish and add them to my gallery. I can't just simply buy these ones. All right. The game wants me to go back to the base. I just had fun exploring. So yeah, let's head back and see what the shovel's all about. I have the shovel, actually. Dig up the earth to see what's hidden underneath one of the piles of earth near the base. Ooh, look at you. That is a very colorful cuttlefish. Uh, we've already seen those, though. Did we see octopus? I actually don't even know. Okay, time to dig. <laughs> I love that it uses the same aquarium aquascaping shovel. Yeah, I would use a bigger shovel if I was in the middle of the sea, but okay. What is inside this massive mound? Ah, a creepy statue. Sick. Turn a base to pick up a crowbar. What am I doing? A freaking heist? Like, why do I need a crowbar right now? I didn't even know there was one here. Oh, thanks. Oh, I don't want to take a picture of it. What's inside of you, little... Oh, it's a mini game. Oh, it's a pearl. Shocking. I totally expected that, honestly. Take the pearl and bring it to your companion in the base to receive your reward. Interesting. So there's, like, treasures we can find now, too? Hey, I have gotten a pearl. $650. We gotta get more of those. Ah, hello, airfish. Welcome to the, to the hub. Uh, yeah, I'm glad I came back because I don't think these were here before. I think I unlocked them while I was taking pictures. I just wanted to see if I had enough to unlock the shark cage. I'm assuming that's what this is. I need 82. Oh, God. That is so many pictures. I'm having a hard time. No, I don't want to return. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I was wondering if I could use the computer to buy anything. What was that noise? Oh. Oh, that's all the things I got. How exciting. So we did get some new fish, as you can clearly see. Uh, we definitely didn't have manta rays before. Mahi, mahi. Uh, so some rather big fish, which is great, because my uh, big tank is rather barren. But uh, we're going to head back out, because I want to get the shark enclosure. The irony is I'm swimming around with these guys. I don't know if we need a shark enclosure or a shark cage, but uh, I'm not going to question it. I'm really glad I came back, though, because holy crap, I'm so much faster. Oh, that's lame. I can't... <laughs> oh, I don't know why they would do that. So, yeah, I can't use uh, the camera and the fins at the same time. So, not as useful as I hoped for. I don't know why you can't have things on your feet while you're holding something in your hands, but you can't, damn it. Okay, don't tell me this is something I have to dig <laughs> out with this little shovel. Am I... Oh, you stop. Give me a bigger shovel. This doesn't... Oh, my God, it actually does take a while as well. That dude beating up a snake? That's kind of badass, honestly. Oh my god, this is taking me so long. Why could you not give me a bigger shovel? All right, smile for the gram. I Really? Oh, there we go. Sometimes it's hard to take the pictures, too, so I'm probably missing a lot of them. Oh, I wonder what's behind these giant barrels. Oh, a sculpture. You're not hiding from me. Maybe you are? Wait, I have to... Uh, maybe I'm supposed to use the crowbar on this? What? I can't... I need pictures! Unlock the item to be able to take a photo of it. How do I unlock it? What do you... What the hell? Oh, hammer maybe? What the... Oh, yeah. There we go. Well, didn't explain this. There we go. What was that? I get something else for this, too. What? It, what's the plus one? I'm trying to figure out what that thing is. Oh, it's just trash, I think. I think it's just an image of trash. Okay. Now I can take a good picture of you. One thing I haven't found yet, which is pretty surprising, is uh, the hammerhead shark. I would obviously love that to add to my big tank. So, I don't know how I'm not seeing it. It's not like this area is that big. I know there's one type of stingray that I'm missing as well, which is why I'm taking pictures of those. But yeah, I don't know where the hell he is, but he's nowhere to be found. Oh, this is it right here. This is it. Yes, I knew that was the one I didn't see because he was out in the middle of nowhere. All right, so I got all my stingrays. How the hell do I not see a massive shark? Oh, you know what? I wonder if that's why I need the shark cage. I can't even see the hammerhead until I get it. I bet that's it, because I have looked for way too long. Let's go see how many more I need. I forget. I'm in the 70s right now. So I need six more pictures. That, that's actually, I think there's a max of, yeah, 96. So oh, I'm nearing the end. 
Most of the things I need are these statues, so I'm gonna have to go look around for mounds. They're easy to miss when you're high flying around like this. Ah, that's what I'm looking for. All these things, the wood that hides all these relics that I need to find. Don't be a fake. I need one more picture, please. Ah. Uh, oh, you know what? I'm seeing, I, I remember an image. I think it's these. I might actually need these. Oh my god, how did I remember that? I have enough now. <laughs> Click on the cage while holding the camera to find sharks. Oh. <laughs> okay. Did I bait the cage or something? Well, there's the hammerhead that I need. Oh god. Come on. <laughs> this isn't even working. <laughs> I mean, the sharks are nice here at least, but you could have worked on, you know, a pathing thing for these guys. They just go right through the cage. All right. Well, that was anticlimactic if I'm fully honest, but I got the hammerhead that I desperately wanted. I'm assuming that's the only shark that I needed. And yes, we just got what looks to be a barracuda and some sort of other fish. Oh, there's actually uh, three fish we're missing. Don't really care about the rest except for this guy. This guy actually looks co cool, but I couldn't find him. And yeah, we missed a whole crap load of statues. I don't care about statues, though. All right, so not bad for our first voyage. We got pretty much the majority of it done. Let's head back and return to my oceanarium. And look at all that stuff. Definitely the biggest update when it comes to just items. Uh, there is an insane amount we can now add to our aquariums here. So what I want to do, I don't have a lot of money right now. I'm going to have to earn a bit of money, but I want to make this thing look like a really good aquarium. I know I have a lot of other small aquariums I need to do, but this thing looks so boring right now. All right, one auto feeder should feed this whole aquarium, right? That's fine. Um, let's actually, because so many of the plants are so small in this game, I do want to add some of these um, decorations because I think it will look really, really cool. A submarine? Okay, chill. Well, yeah, we'll buy that. All right, I'm just going to add one statue. I just want the guy fighting the serpent just because it looks really cool in my opinion. Okay, good enough for now. So we'll add a T-Rex skull there. Okay, the submarine's so small. It's a model. Damn, even the... See, that's my issue. This aquarium's so big. This is as big as I can make this thing. And it's just dwarfed by the size of this aquarium. I need some sort of major accent piece, but I can't get any of them. I can't even make big plants. So I guess we're just gonna have to fill this thing up with fish. Speak... Oh my god. 25,000 for one... Oh, I got some grinding to do. All right, and I spent way too long idling, and now we at least have some money in the bank. Ah, uh, also, I'm earning a lot more now. I've been slowly adding some basic fish to the aquarium, but I wanted to save the fun part for you. So we're at 93,000 now. I was looking through the list. A lot of these guys are not cheap. This is like end game content. So I definitely want one big... Oh, do I want a big boy shark? Yeah, we're going to do one truly big hammerhead, and then we're going to go down to some babies because they should grow over time as well. Now, before I spend too much money, let's buy some of the other guys that we uh, caught today because they're not cheap, but they're not, definitely not as bad. As I said, I put a lot in this tank already. It's hard to tell, though, because, I mean, it's such a big freaking tank. Okay, these aren't bad either, so we'll buy uh, five of those and throw those guys in the tank. Very small at the start, but they should get big. The manta ray, also extremely expensive. We'll get, like, a mid-tier. Let's buy... Uh, oh, my God, I'm already at... <laughs> it's so easy to spend money. I'm already at 39000 Uh, Okay, let's maybe buy... Uh, three of those little guys. I wanted to buy a big one, but uh, yeah, I'm already out of money. Did I buy everything? I, I want the Mahi Mahi. That's for sure. I already added turtles before this episode. All right. We want a big Mahi Mahi. Well, I envision this beautiful aquarium with millions of fish in it. it. Really doesn't look like there's like 300 grand worth of fish in here, but sharks aren't cheap, I guess. The Mahi Mahi are actually one of my favorites. They're just so pretty because they're so uh, colorful. I don't even see. Okay, the hammerhead's there. Where's all my old sharks? I guess it's just they're so, they seem so small because they're so far away. Mind you, some of them are rather small. The Mahi Mahi are dwarfing some of my original sharks. I mean, it looks good. Definitely not as good as I wanted, though. We'll have to earn, you know, four or five hundred thousand to get where I want this thing to be. And with, you know, three or four thousand a day, that's going to take a while. Let's see how much we're going to earn now, though. I just got to wait until the day's over. Yeah, that's the downside of this. It takes a long time idling. All right, it's time to invite the residents in. 
so we shall do that i was really hoping to do some of these small aquariums today but i didn't expect to be getting so many big fish i guess more deep sea diving it makes sense now it doesn't look so bad oh looking at it from those views it actually looks pretty damn good my my under or my cave area is still definitely my favorite in this area though how do we do that didn't even change oh i did, honestly did not even notice that i have cave money and money earned on this list how many times have this have i done this and i didn't even notice that uh no wonder why i was seemingly earning more money than it seemed like but yeah those fish really didn't change the money earned at all so yeah a hundred hundred thousand dollars well spent i guess maybe i should have finished my other tanks first i just wanted to see some of the new big guys all right so that's gonna wrap up this episode here guys i hope you guys enjoyed checking out this really awesome new update now let me know in the comments below if you do want to see some more because i would like to you know actually finish up this place make the rest of the aquarium look as good as these tanks in here and yeah i believe there's a, a job that we haven't done as well so there's still definitely more we can do on this game if you guys do enjoy it of course as always thanks for watching and liking and i'll see you in the next one